Thank you, Megan. You're so tall, I lost my hat. Oh. Well, thank you, thank you so much. Let me start by saying, let's go, girls. Okay. Uh, now listen, when I wrote the phrase, man, I feel like a woman, I honestly I had no idea at the time that it would become an undercurrent of a decades-long career. It's amazing how just one statement can empower so many. And man, I feel like a woman has been adopted by an array of fantastic communities all around the world and become a genuine path of power and progress for women to, I mean, women in country music, right? Which brings me so much joy. Thank you to CMT for pushing the equal play agenda and thank you for always supporting me. In fact, you know what, you may not know this, but the CMT Rising Star Award was my very first award ever. 30, 30 years ago, that was in 1993. So CMT holds a very special place in my heart. And I promise I will continue to champion the many outstanding country artists who are not currently played, they're not streamed, toured, signed, or awarded at the level they deserve. So I believe in an all-inclusive country music, we're family. This is a genre of music with a rich history that raised and nurtured my own songwriting and performance and recording career from childhood. Currently, the industry standard does a real disservice to this. Now, let us, the country music industry, do our part to close the gap and provide an equal workspace for all talent. This year, I'm taking many amazing artists on my Queen of Me tour. Lily, Tennille, Lindsay, Haley, Brayland, Robin, Priscilla, Mickey, and several more. And my hope is that this opportunity and spotlight impresses you much and lifts up the careers of these very talented people on their journey. I will continue to do my best as a trailblazer and together let's ensure that all our fellow artists get equal play regardless of gender, age, or race. Thank you again for honoring me and the CMC Equal Play Award. And a special thank you to all my fans. I'm truly touched for this moment. Thank you.